landscape and the wildebeest and things like that. Just take it easy. There, lion, lion, lion! Woohoo! There he is, big male lion. Yay, it's so excited! Just catch up with him here. There, good impala! Ooh, which Birmingham do we have? This is so exciting. I'm gonna jump right in front of him so we can get him walking. Is it Tinyo? or is it Mfumo? Oh, David, how excited are you right now? I'm like a little girl. It is. Is it? Who is this? Who is this? Is it Mfumo? I feel like I've forgotten the Birmingham's now. No, is it? Who is it? Is, is it Mfumo? Rebecca? Louise? Help! Help, help. I think it is Mfumo. There's another male lion, David. There's two. He's just, he's going to come out here. He, so the pole, you can just see him moving. He'll come straight towards us. I don't know who, which lions we've got. I'm so excited. I've forgotten what everybody looks like. Let me just call this in quickly. I've got two Madonna and Gala. No, I can't. Never mind. We'll call it in just now. Hello boys, this is fantastic. This is obviously who's been doing all the calling. Let's see if we can get a view of the other lion. Where did he go David? Did you see? Is he still there? Oh, he's sitting down. They're both sitting down now. So I think, I think, I think this is Tinyo. He's just, his face doesn't look, oh, that, let's go around. Let me go, let's go and confirm the other male line and then I think we'll know for sure. I've forgotten. It's been such a long time since I've seen these boys now. I've completely forgotten which line is which, but we shall look at them and get them out. But I think that could be Tinyo. Hmm. Let's see who's around the corner. Oh, hello, handsome. Yes, that is Tenyo. This is Mfumo. Hello, boy. Hello, big boy. And isn't he beautiful? Still got a little bit of a gash on his face, but it looks like it's healed very well. Especially the ones that he had under his eye. He was a little bit worried about that. But it seems as though it has healed up nicely. And it's still just a very, very small gash that he's got left from his issue that he had with the myasis but like I said that's gonna it's gonna keep happening for the next few months every time that scab forms over his face if he rubs his paw if he gets into an argument with a, his brother or one of the Nkahuma lionesses then that scab is going to come off of his face but it'll be all right it's not anything to worry about they're good and healthy and I'm just so happy to have two of the Birminghams back on the property. Thank you very much gorgeous boys. Let me very quickly call, I'm going to call the sighting in actually just in a moment and uh, hopefully hopefully somebody else would like to come and join us because this is very very nice. I don't know when we last seen the Birminghams, it's been quite some time now hey David? When was the last I can't, I literally cannot even tell you the last time that I saw, no, you know where it was, it was at Arethusa. No, it was after Arethusa, it was when we had Nsuku at the dam. That was the last time I saw Birmingham, and that must be about a week ago now, easily. Up he goes again. Now, just remember, we do have these big roofs on, because it was raining earlier, so occasionally you're going to see a black bar every now and then. I do apologize for this, it's just very tricky when they are <clears throat> when they are moving around. Morning mobile to my daughter. Nope, my radio is not working. Okay. That's not good. We shall have to ask James to call it in. Re Rebecca, if you can tell James to please call the sighting in, we're just off on Pilot Plains Road. 
Should we reposition, David? Let's reposition. Seems as though my gum drive radio is not working for some reason. Or all of a sudden it was working just now. But that's fine. We'll just enjoy these lions. Hi, oh, big boys. They look good. They must have walked quite far because I'm pretty sure they've come from wherever the Nkuhumas are. Well, maybe, maybe they've even crossed. That's so exciting. So we've got lots to go and look for this morning. Try and get right in front. I think we'll follow Mfumo. Mfumo, we've been absent for quite some time, Tinyo. Good morning. But they're quite close to the boundary here. We're actually almost on Gar on Triple M. We're not far. Where are you going? Are you going to sit under there? Don't go sit under there. We're just doing laps and circles now. <laughs> I think he's settling in for the morning. We'll do this, David, then we can do both of them. Yes. So we've got Mfumo, who's now tucked himself underneath a guari tree in all the long grass. And actually, can you see that as we go in, look how bare it is. All the sand you can start to see in between the grasses. But as soon as you go underneath the trees where Mfumo is sitting, there's so much more grass under there. And it's funny how the animals will just sort of feed around those areas and feed out in, in the open. And then they sort of head to these last resorts. But we're not going anywhere. We're definitely going to stick with the Birminghams and hopefully we'll be able to pick up on the Nkuhumas too. But it seems Steph has taken off his rain jacket and he's put on his walking shoes. He's out and about, he'd like to say. Good morning. 